Oh, hey guys, what's up? Stand the man here. Oh lord, this is getting old stuff for the birds, man. I'm serious. Well, it's January. I ain't doing much out in the yard. I'm hibernating. But I was uh, searching YouTube and uh, I found some uh, YouTube movies about cloning. Cloning various plants and, you know, making replicas of the plants and I thought, well, the kids always, always want, they're always, they're always fussing about my orange tree, my grand's orange tree she gave me, saying, well, Pops, when you pass on, I want the tree, and, you know, Lord have mercy, I got four kids, you know, I, they, they can't all have it, so I figured I'd go ahead and uh, follow the directions I've seen on a couple of YouTube videos about uh, cloning trees and grafting, and uh, I got... 18 starts off of my Graham's tree, all rooted to growing, growing pretty good in pots. I also built myself a cloning chamber so I can uh, make starts about anything I want to make, make a start of. I got cherry trees, two types of apple trees. I got a, uh, oh mercy, what if I got? I got a, 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 a wari. Satsuma orange, I'm getting rooted. A Meyer lemon tree, I'm getting rooted. And a Rio red grapefruit, sweet grapefruit. None of this do make your mouth all pucker up grapefruit. I'm not into sour things, man. That ain't good. Yeah, I cloned my grandma's tree. So far, I've. Uh, Got a lime grafted to it. Maybe it'll produce fruit this summer. I don't know. I mean, my Graham's orange tree does grow oranges, but they're small. And I can't remember what seed it was I put in my Graham's flower pot when I was a kid. But none of the oranges have ever gotten big. So I'm kind of thinking maybe it's it. Graham's gave me a cutie orange, and I, that's why I planted it in a flower pot. I I I was four years old. I I don't remember. <laughs> what can I say? But I grafted a whole bunch, not grafted, but I, I cloned I cloned the orange tree for the kids. And uh, I wound up with 18 cuttings that actually rooted. And I rooted them in this cloning chamber. I've uh, got cherries, cher my, I, I cloned my cherry tree, I cloned my apple trees, uh, I cloned uh, my rose bushes. Them rose bushes are beautiful when they bloom out. I mean, just fragrant. I, mean, I can smell them on the porch just chilling out there, tinkering on the porch. Beautiful orange trees. So, uh, when this whole thing takes root, I will have quite a variety to give to the kids or who else ever, whoever else wants them. You know, I mean, it's all good. But in the meantime, I was searching for information on YouTube about cloning and grafting. I ran across videos on, uh, of all things, get this, gold prospecting. So I got interested in that. So now I'm going to zoom off in that direction for a while. And I'm putting all my equipment together and uh, making a small sluice. And they got me what they call a blue bowl for refining concentrate. Because naturally when you uh, pan for gold, you don't get a whole bunch. I mean, you might, you're lucky if you wind up wind up with a gram or two, you know. I mean, if you get a couple grams of gold while you're out panning or sluicing, you're doing pretty doggone good. But you figure three, a, a, a troy ounce, which is like, I think, 31 grams, 30 grams, or something like that, is worth like 1,900 bucks. Hey, can't go wrong, man, for a minimal investment. And I'm going to build my own sluice and, and uh, build most of my own, uh, uh, I don't know, what am I trying to say, supplies and equipment. I priced 
factory sleuths on on YouTube, and it's they're just insane. I'm not I'm not going to sorry I'm not giving you 1,200 bucks for something I can make for myself for 50. I mean that's 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 just idiotic. But we'll see how that project goes. I mean, I'm just putting together all my doodads for when it warms up. It warms up. Yeah. You know. We'll see how the gold adventure goes. That, that's off in the far, the, the, I would say far future, a couple months. Yeah, look, Grow Chamber's working out great, man. Fantastic. I can't complain. It's doing great. I'll eventually get back to my solar panels. <laughs> That's just how I am, you know. I I find something that picks my interest, and and I'll, I'll explore that concept and do some experiments and tinker with it and refine the concept until I kind of get the hang of what's going on. That's just the way I am. Used to drive the kids' mom nuts. <laughs> like all this right here, it's in my living room, and, and she'd be blowing the top. But then most women would, I suppose, you know. I don't have a garage, or I'd do it out there, you know, so it is what it is. You know, that's all I got. I uh, want to wish everybody a great day. Be good. Be good at it. God bless. Oh, mercy. Let's get an old stuff ain't good.